Aleichem and welcome to Online Smicha. Today we'll discuss a halach on this week's Parsha, Parshas Re'ei. The Pasuk in Revi, Perik Yudal, it says, Bonim atem la Hashem aleikeichem. B'nei Yisro, we are all the children of the Eibishter. Le'isiz goyedudu, v'le'isasimu korcha b'nei neichem l'mes. Rachman al-Otzlan, if there's a situation of a mess, don't hurt yourself, don't do, don't do any uh, carving out any fle- on the flesh. Don't make any wounds in your flesh. As Rashi explains, that's how the Emoidium would do when Rahman al in a situation of a death in, the, in the, uh, a friend or family. A Yid is not allowed to do that. Because we are the children of Hashem. And for children of Hashem, it's right, it's proper to be to look good, to be proper. And that with all these cuts that uh, they do to themselves. The Ramban quotes a shayla, a, a pshat, uh, on, uh, a shayla on this Rashi. He says, according to Rashi, that we are the bun of Shalmokim Noim, why is the Isser specifically about a mess? That you're not allowed to do this, Rahman al a situation of a mess. For a Yid who is a Ben Melech, he should never be able to do should always apply even not in a situation of a mess and Itaka brings from the Evan Ezra that he says that Pshat is like this once the Ebesha says and we realize that we are Hashem's children and the Ebesha loves every, every Yid more than a physical father loves his child, Lois is going to do a kol mashiyasa. You shouldn't hurt yourself for anything that takes place. Ki kol mashiyasa, whatever Hashem does, letoivu. V'im loytivinu, loytivinu, kasha loyuvan, kasha loyavinu ha'bonim mektanim ma'isavim. And perhaps sometimes you will not see that it's good, but it's just like a young child. After all, and a young child, as he's raising, raising and, and growing up and to be who he is, he perhaps doesn't see all the good that his parents do for him. But remember, that you are a holy nation, and you are not like the rest of the nations. Al don't do what they do. So the but Evan Ezra ex, obvious, uh, actually extended this shot of Bonim Atam Hashem Alekechem, not necessarily to this this behavior that uh, comes about because of the tire of a mess. He says, Bechlau, and anything that takes place in the world, remember you are Hashem's children, Hashem is in control, and Hashem is doing the right thing for you. The Ramban sort of makes a compromise, and he says, and the Pasuk continues and says that we are a Am Kaddish, we are a holy nation. Why is it we going back to the point of Am Kaddish? Says the Ramban. This is a guarantee, a guarantee for all for the existence of every nefesh. That since we are a Am Kaddish, and the Abishter will not let any nefesh fall. It doesn't make sense for anybody to hurt himself in any way, shape, or form because of a tsar of a mess. And even if Rahman al the mess passes away very young. Why? The because the, the, the nature is that people Rahman al cry when a close friend of yours departs. However, Remember that the nefesh that departed will be forever. And that's why Chazal say that it's a iserless abel al nefesh yoisamidai. To cry and to feel bad for a short period of time, yes. But to remember that I'm Kaddish and we are Hashem's people and Hashem's nation and the, as the Lashna Rambam, the Haftacha will be kim and the so fun. If the nefesh will last forever and ever, it's not right to extend that mourning process for too long. Rahman al The fact that we are called Banim is brought in the Gemara. And the Gemara says 
Hisvakach min echod im Rabbi Akiva. There was a mina, a Picardus, had a debate with Rabbi Akiva. And he asked him, Im Yisrael Kruim Bonim or Yavadim? Make up your mind. Are Yidin considered Hashem's children? Or are Yidin considered Hashem's Avadim, slaves? So Rabbi Akiva used this Pasik. The Pasik says clearly, Bonim Atem Hashem Alikechem. So the min, the Picardus, said, Wait, I have another Pasik. The Pasik says, Kli Bonim Yisrael Avadim. The Abisha refers to us as his slaves. So, Rabbi Akiva made, made a compromise, and he said, and he explained, When you didn't do what they were supposed to do, they fulfill the will of the Abishter, we are referred to as his children. In that situation, we are called his slaves. And that's why we keep on saying Avinu, Malkenu, our father, our king, because it depends on our commitment, our dedication to fulfilling Torah mitzvahs. Now it doesn't really say that Rabbi Akiva contradicted and said we are not his slaves. We are. We are both. But when we are in a better level, it's Bunim. When we are lower level, it's Avadim. Well, some of Farshim actually say even Avadim is not a low title. Because the best of people, Maishir Rabbeinu, is referred to Eved Hashem. Eved Hashem, and yet we, we don't find anybody closer to the Abishter and Maishir Rabbeinu. And Maishir is referred to as an Eved. So p- perhaps these are both miles. They're both titles with high titles that are given to Kalal Yisro, one above each, uh, one above another, but they're not negative terms. Yashikoyach, and please join us again next week.